There we go. This is what we're gonna be shooting at today. Hell yeah. <laughs> What's up team? Today we're gonna to be doing a shooting video for you guys with a Benjamin Bulldog 357. These are our targets. We've got our little deer target which is about the same size as the does i see around here and we've got an old protron tv so um we're about 50 yards from where we're, gonna, where we're gonna set up at so stay with us let's get it going so for those of you who are not familiar with the bulldog the benjamin bulldog is a big bore air rifle 3000 psi is what you feel it to and this bad boy is a beast worth it worth every penny I got the, um, I believe it's called the Sportsman package. Got it in camo, came with a bipod scope. Otherwise, uh, when you purchase it, it doesn't come with a scope. I'm gonna turn this table around. Obviously, it's not gonna work like this. There we go. All right, there we go, we set up now. All right, and the way you load it, they come with this, uh, they come with one five round clip. We're gonna shoot the nozzles first. These bad boys are very accurate. To get this thing cocked, all you do is make sure safety's on. I'm going to go ahead and cock it back. Just open up. You're cocked. You have to cock it to load it. Your clip slides in. Slides in. And then you just close them up. And you're ready to fire. Let's shoot this bad boy a couple times. All right, some good information is when you get to the end of your clip, see how it's red? That means we are out. So we're going to go take a look at what we did at the target down there and, um, I think we're shooting pretty bad off, but when you're out, just go ahead and pull the clip out and then um, you'll reload it, safety back on, and um, we'll go back in with the, um, the Nielsen 142 grain. Let's go shake it, bud. Talk about a non-ideal shooting situation. Hey, but this is real life. This is how it happens. Um, do what? Yep, you're shooting pretty good. Can I punch the TV? No, don't punch the TV. I'm going to do it. No, you can't punch it. You want to cut your hand wide open? Good God. All right. So here's what we've got. I know there's no X on this um, TV, but I was shooting dead center of the TV, so it'd be about here. So we're shooting just a little off and high. But yeah, not too bad. It's been sitting in the closet for a couple months. Um, I'm not going to make any adjustments right now. We're going to go ahead and shoot the uh, Nielsen ammo and see what we get. All right. We're going to load up with the Nielsen ammo. 142 grain, Motel. Motel. We're going to shoot the last two. The five in the clip. All right, this is my last shot for this, so I'm gonna try to shoot it at the Protron, where it says Protron, where I'm gonna be shooting. All right, Jack, you're up. I can't lift this thing with anything, so... Aim it at the target. Safety's... Okay, I can't. Let me look here. Are you looking through it at the target? I can't. 
trying to shoot. Set it on the edge of the table right there. Is that better? You can pick it up and adjust it and move it and all that good stuff. Got it. Okay, here. Safety, uh, safety off. Find the trigger. Easy. Make a shot when you're ready. Okay, finger off the trigger. Be your last shot. Finger up here. Find the trigger. Safety off. Okay, hold on. You're live now. Hold on. Don't pull the trigger yet. Yeah, you're live. Make a good shot. Aim. You think you just hit just the TV? This is definitely not the ideal shooting uh, placement here, team. Table's on level, chair's on a hill. But hey, this ain't siding it. We're not siding it in. It's just shooting practice. There's a big difference. Oh yeah, those are shooting. Those are shooting a lot more accurately. That's where you hit it at. We just shot several in the same hole. Look, there's there's the one that I shot at the protra on it hit right there. Bam. So you missed. So you must have hit here. And then the Nielsen's definitely a couple I, went in the I same hole. Right here. But the Nielsen's are definitely because that's that's the middle, that's where I was aiming at. I didn't hit the deer. No, see, I wasn't shooting at the deer. Definitely took one right there though. That was good. Yeah. That one's ready. You want to shoot the the ballistics or the Nielsen? Ballistics. Why? Well, this time we're gonna make it a little competition. <laughs> we ain't gonna do shooting at the um just to hit the target. We're gonna do accuracy at this point. We'll see. There's our target right there, team. Gotta be innovative around here, around these parts. I'll stick that bad boy in there. Well, we'll go for the uh, we'll go for the leaves this time. Always be clear, sure your target and what's behind it. No, it's not like I hit. Let's shoot. Let you shoot five. I hit it. Okay, she's live now. Safety's not on. Okay. Shoot for the leaf with the nozzers. Make sure you keep your eye looking down range until after the shot. It's clear. You're you're picking your head up. Stay in it. Shot three. Make a good shot. Take a deep breath. Squeeze the trigger. Leaf moves. The leaf did move. I think you might have victory. Let's go. This is what shot for? Yeah. What are you doing, bro? Shot. I think you got one more. Are you making good shots or what? Yeah. You think you're making good shots? Yeah, you need to stay in it longer. You're not like following through. As soon as you pull the trigger, you're looking at me. Don't do that. What? Keep watching down range. See, you look right at me again. Smoked it. Did I hit this one? You didn't hit that one, but you definitely hit that one. Hell, that's one point for you. So you got one point out of five. Here, keep that. That's your trophy. I All shot right. right 
right through it. Let me grab me another target. See if I can't. That one was broke off a little bit. Oh, this one's already got holes in it. <laughs> yeah, that's cheating, ain't it? All right, here we go. I shot the deer. All right, so you shot the, which ones were you shooting? Oh, no, I mean the bullets. You shot the nozzles, right? All right, you shot the nozzles, look. I shot it twice. No hole. All right, let me okay. see, where's the other shot? I hit it right at the top of the stem. Oh, you did? Two times? Mm -hmm. I hit it twice. <laughs> okay, let's go, let's go. Call down the thunder, mister. You call down the thunder. We'll see what we can do. You have to shoot it. Shoot it. I think I nailed it on that one. So I shot I think you. I smoked you on that one, buddy. I'm pretty sure I made contact with it. No. <laughs> Loose grip. Slow pull. Miss. Still got a lot of power under um under two thousand. Definitely for target practice. I want to start with some air in it. Otherwise, uh That's one. Just for all the cheese. No, there's one more. Oh yeah. Dang it. Miss it. Huh. No, I don't think you should put them. Yeah, you have. Yeah. Shot that one. He only shot four last time. But the CV fell. I think I got at least four. We'll see. <laughs> Saved. Saved. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You hit it once earlier. I hit it once. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. That was a good game, bro. We tied. I hit, I hit it twice. Uh, I know, that's what you're Where did I hit it by? Where did I hit it at? Oh, did I cut the bottom off? Wait a minute. Does it look like two? Does no, it look not. like two? No, it doesn't. Well, either way. Look at the shot plate in there, buddy. I mean, now granted, we came illy prepared to do a competition here. We just wanted to come out and do some shooting. But, um, yes. check it out. Um, Aiming, I've always been aiming right down the middle here. That is not bad. That I mean, was my shot to knock the TV down. Overall, that many shots into this bad boy. Well, def we definitely have um, at least one hit in the tree here. We're definitely not in the in the shape of going deer hunting, but that stuff will come later. 
for now, we're just having fun. All right, everybody. Well, all in all, that doesn't seem too bad. I mean, you figure when we first started, the plan was just to hit the TV, uh, bring Jack up, let him have a good time shooting the bulldog. Something we rarely get to do. Cut this other camera off. But yeah, so that's, I mean, that's not bad from the get-go. I was aiming dead center of the TV. So definitely every single shot was pulling to the left for the most part. Uh, I'll be honest with you. When I was, I don't know, when I started to figure that out towards my last shot there, I actually started aiming about an inch over just so I could try to at least get one so the boy wouldn't beat me. But uh, yeah, great time. A lot of fun. Well, that was a blast. I appreciate all you guys being here, um, enjoying this with us. Uh, there it is one more time. That's the final, <laughs> uh, final demolition of the TV. Well, again, thanks for watching. Um, if you are into the Benjamin Bulldog or you want to find out more about it, uh, I'll put up um, a playlist for the Benjamin Bulldog. I've used it a lot deer hunting. Uh, I've got to unbox it. So check, check out the playlist if you want to see more about the Benjamin Bulldog. Um, that's going to do it for us today. Um, it was a good time. Like I said, the whole plan was to get out here, do a little shoot and have a little fun. Of course, with guys, you know, it normally turns into a competition of sorts, but um, we're definitely not in hunting shape just yet. We'll come out and do some more shooting as time goes. It's definitely shooting uh, to the left by an inch or two, for sure. That's how I got that last um, tying shot in, was I shot inch or two, probably inch and a half, to the right of the target, and I was able to, to clip it, so. Well, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. As always, I've got a lot more videos to come. I really appreciate you watching. Special thanks to all my subscribers, and I'll see you on the next one.